Okay, I think we're online now, so yay for that. I'm also checking a few things, like, uh, oh fuck. Don't I have, oh my god, no, I don't have it. I'm there, my god. Okay, but first of all, welcome everyone to this uh, weekend stream again. This is the, probably this will be the last uh, day I'm going to be streaming a whole, no, not, this will be the last weekend that I will be streaming a horror game in October. So, yeah, just so you guys know. But anyways, let me start this game now. What is it? Game for the is a dating. I don't care. Uh, there we go. First three. Okay, let's see if you guys can be able to see some. I mean, you can see my... Ow, my ears! Again! Ah! Also right there, Hajime, welcome! Welcome to the stream! Day. Okay. So finally, we are ready to start the finale of Cursed 3. So the first thing that I'm gonna be doing, yeah, I'm here in this area right now because this is where we need to go and fight. Also, I've been grinding a little bit. Shit. I've been grinding a little bit, so thankfully I'm a little stronger now. And I'm actually happy for that. Okay, first of all, and before I forget... Gosh darn it. Okay, let's try and see if I can do this right. Oh! That was stupidity of mine. I like the fact that you can wield... Uh... Dual wield. Also... I leveled up a little too much in the past stream, so... Yeah, you guys are gonna see me a little strong tonight. But... Big thanks to Shade. Because he was kind enough to send me the... The actual picture of how this puzzle looks solved. So I'm gonna see if I can work on that right now. Because, my god, this puzzle is really, really confusing. Oh, I think this is the one that needs to be solved at the end. So I decided that because this is literally we are close to the ending of the game. I'm gonna try to focus on finish the things and business that I unfin that I haven't finished. And thankfully things are not gonna be that bad. So this puzzle is gonna take only a little bit of time. But hopefully without too much problems this will be easy. So after that, it's gonna be this. Also, it's gonna be this one. Yeah, these puzzles are really, really complicated, like you guys can see. Actually, I'm gonna be doing it like this. So I can start moving all these parts. So there we go. So now that we got that there, all the purple parts are need to be up there. So we're gonna try to focus on completing that part. But also a couple of you guys are doing fine uh, this nice enjoyable weekend for the for the time. Okay, that will be nice for a moment. So the next parts I need to move is these ones actually. Yeah, I need to pull that one there. And then I'm gonna need to pull these ones. Uh... Oh, you know what? I might be able to do this. If I do it like this, probably. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah, there we go. Actually, no. 
Probably not. Hmm. Hold on. Maybe I can do something. Hmm. Okay, that's almost complete. Yeah, this, have, this is gonna be a really tough type of puzzle that I will need to hold here. Okay, there we go. Meep, meep, meep. Okay, that's the second dragon. Meanwhile, before getting off PC, I went to your chat and do a little funeral offering in a map that I know. Oh! That sounds... I don't know how to say about that, but hopefully nothing that was really too serious. What am I thinking? So this is gonna be the jello one. So that will be the jello one. So that means now it needs to be this one. Yeah, this is almost there. So it's gonna need to be the jello. I might probably be able to hold this. If I can make this work somehow. I might probably be able to make this work somehow. Uh, not, not really, sadly. Well, that is the yellow part. Now I just need to find a way to push the entire orange on top of that. Hmm. You know what? I might be able to do this. Okay, yeah, there is a high chance that I... There we go. Okay, that dragon is complete too. Okay, now here comes the annoying part. It's from the Trials game as I realized something. Oh, okay, oh, that's that's a neat detail. Yeah, you told me that there was a map of that game. Okay, so that needs to be here. So, kind of like that. So we need to put now this here. Oh, we made it. There we go. Oh my god, this is this was tough as hell. Beep. Oh, that's a puzzle. Hooray for that. Oh. Uh, what I'm gonna do is... I'm gonna go back real quick. To one place in particular. You guys will see. But yeah, thank you so much, Shade, for sending me this little picture. So I can see the thing. Okay, so I'm going to go here. Because right now I got a lot of things to do, so you guys will see real soon. Well, here I only have a little bit of things. You guys can see that I have a lot of spear like spears on this side. So that means I can buy this spell. Holy Flame Burn the Wicked to Ash. This Ignis. And also... That means I can buy something else. And that is this. This is another weapon. And not only that, but... With the last two worlds that we got here, we can actually uh, increase the power of our little partners here. Like this guy. I see, so this is an energy source of my kind. With this, we can become an unseen of the darkness itself. Now, if we hide as long as nothing sees you do it, you shall not be found. This is, I promise. So basically, this guy becomes more stealthy. So that's why I didn't use it, because it was not really that important. And the fade. Hey, where did you get that? From a store. You can buy these things. <laughs> but anyways, uh, the fade... At the, not only she can freeze enemies, but she can also heal you at the same time. So that's what the Fairy does. Anyway, 
now all the partners are fully maxed out. And we also... We almost got all the spells. So that means there is one last thing to do. And that will be... Uh... Okay, let's see. was replying to a friend. But anyways, uh, we need to go back here now. Labote! Hello there. Welcome. So this is the... We got this new weapon. Yeah, it's a flying tower. And it takes a little bit of time. I don't know how useful it's gonna be against the boss, but I'm gonna try for sure. So we are ready to fight the boss of this area. That is right here. This boss is gonna be really problematic. You guys will see why. I'm gonna be using this guy. You guys saw me fight this guy. And it's gonna be quite problematic. So let's try. Actually, I wonder if I can destroy both of the eyes with. It needs to be the sword. Oh god. Okay, there we go. Oh, there is no sound. Suddenly there is no sound on the boss. But it's okay. So this is how the boss works. You need to return the energy spheres right into the nose. But we got no sound, so I don't know how this is gonna work. I think even the music lag. Yeah, the, everything about this game just... it's... busted. I don't know how I can be able to hit the nose, honestly. It looks tough. Oh, there we go, that's one hit. I'm sorry that the music sounds like literally a scratch disc. I should see if I can kill myself, so... At least you guys can be able to hear something. Also, these eyes are really split. Oh. Also, I wonder if the magic ball... Hold on. Maybe not the magic ball, but the... But the thing. What is the name? What if I use the... Elemental fire that I got and try to attack him. It doesn't work at all. Okay, this is fantastic. I guess you also broke the game too. Yeah, you know what? Let me see if I can do something. Okay, I know that I need to use the sword, so that's good to know. I'm gonna use this teleporting spell so I can leave this room and see if that works oh I can't uh, okay what if I load state oh apparently the game is broken <laughs> I completely broke the game! Yep! <laughs> what a good start! I love it. I literally broke the game by getting hit in the middle of the fight. But at least it, it let me know that I need to use the sword. 
Dino quebrado, más bien. Pero it's okay. Oh no, that means I need to do the fucking puzzle again. Damn it. Do I need to do the puzzle again? I think I do. Damn it. I need to do the stupid puzzle again. But let me grab, let me buy the things first. Gosh darn it, I need to do the puzzle again. But this time I swear to god that I'm gonna save. Uh, Ooh, bread. Hmm. Yay, sweet bread. It's kind of hilarious if you think about that. I'm gonna be. To, I'm gonna need to use the. The, I'm gonna need to do the puzzle again, doesn't it? But thankfully, I know what I need to do, so it's not gonna be that tough, I hope. Monster? Not monster, okay. Oh, gosh darn it, yeah, I'm gonna need to do this again, but it's okay. At least I know what I'm aiming for now. Especially because this is the thing. These puzzles are actually uh, mandatory for the game. But it's okay. Nothing that the Dino can deal with. Actually, I'm gonna do it like this. Yeah, the best idea to solve a puzzle like that is actually kind of doing it like that. So there we go. So in that way I can be able to put all of these pieces together. There we go. So now the next one I need to do is actually go for the purple ones. That will be this one and this one. And this time after I complete this puzzle I'm totally gonna go and do the... was saved. Also I need the other pieces, like the tails. If I can pull the tails like that, that will be actually really good. Yeah, you know what? Let's pull the tails up there. There we go. So now I probably should be able to do these. Oh, maybe not. Actually, yeah, maybe I can. There we go. Okay, that's part of the tail. Pirata, welcome! Rare! How oh, you're doing fine, Proto. So we're gonna bring some things up here. You are watching me do this this uh, puzzle again because the game was like, you know what, screw you. And I got screwed. But thankfully this is going way better than the last time. So that's another dragon complete. So that means now we need to pull the yellow dragon. Actually, I think the best will be like this. In that order. So that will be yellow. Now we're gonna need another yellow and another orange. Also, we're gonna have these creepy ass sound effects because reasons. Hmm. That might work. You know what? This might work. Very good. If I can make this somehow. Okay, yeah. I can probably be able to make this work somehow. There we go. This dragon is complete. With that little bit of movement, this dragon is complete. 
So now I need to assemble assemble this dragon. That is gonna be kind of like this. And now I'm gonna need to assemble it like this. Oh, it's almost there. Need to pull this piece all the way there. There we go. Perfect. Oh, now let's let's go back and save because I don't want to do that puzzle again. I'm stupid. How so was the week? Treated you guys. Thankfully, the week was fine. Besides a little problem that I got with my right eye, things are going fine now, so I don't have to worry about that. I'm actually under a little bit of medication, but. Not a bad type of medication, it's actually just a... Uh... <laughs> so don't worry, it's not like, oh god, Dino, what did you... Fuck. No, I don't know, fuck. Shut up! There you go. Okay, let's do this boss now, and hopefully they don't break it. Oh wait, no! I need to change the guy. Okay, there we go. That's one hit. Oh, I need to do that. It's almost dead. Just a few more hits. He will be done. Ow. There we go. Woo! Oh, that was intense. Now we got a key. No, wait. Uh, where is the exit? Exit. Okay. So I need to use a key here. And inside we got this. Perfect. Okay, now we can leave. Eat run, kind of like that. I'm actually glad that it went well. Hey. So there is only one place we need to go now. And my god, it's gonna be a pain for sure. Ah! My lady, your red-haired human friend was here not long ago. He insisted on helping you destroy Malus. Apparently he has an old artifact called the Divine Shield, which protects him from the Void. Yogi was quite resourceful, but his re recklessness could get him killed. It's all the information I have. Okay, thank you. Anyways, let's go here. Eee! Right, is at birth. 94%! We're almost there. You know what? I'm gonna upgrade my partners just so I can get rid of these things. I'm gonna skip the dialogues again. The fact that they, that these three games were made by one person. Yeah, that's a cool thing. Like all these three games were made by one single person. So besides he looking for the sprites. All the original things of the game, he literally drawed them. 
He literally had to draw all the original things and all that stuff. So it's like quite impressive. Okay, so this section. I'm gonna hate it. Why? You guys will see. Uh, Clocky. There's gonna be things jumping at me and scare the crap out of me. Hmm. Nope, I'm gonna go here instead. Okay, I kind of want to see if I can charge this because I want to save. There is two paths. So I came from there. Drawing, coding, writing the story, pretty good. Yeah, actually, that's true. Writing the story, drawing the sprites, uh, coding the game, testing the game because, well, probably his friends helped with that, but still. I'm just waiting here for the... What is the name? Ah! For the clock to... To reload, there we go. Oh, okay. This is it, guys. I think this is gonna be the boss. So, I... I don't know if I'm gonna need this or not. This boss can insta-kill you, by the way. If I remember correctly. This boss can insta kill me if I'm not careful. Yeah, this boss can literally insta-kill you. That's how annoying this boss can be. So the mechanic of this boss is that... This boss literally is gonna... It's like a wall, so... Every certain amount of moves or time... Yeah, that's the fun thing. Every... It's a giant wall. Every certain time... The wall is gonna move forward, and if you don't retreat, the wall is gonna crush you. So basically, that's the mechanic of this thing. And the longer you take to beat this guy, the harder it will be because you will have less time to maneuver. I'm gonna wait and see if I can do this. Yeah, it literally crushes you. But this is the fun thing because. Sounds like Demon Wall from Final Fantasy. A kind of like that. Imagine it like the Demon Wall from Final Fantasy. But the fun thing is like, if you see that, the wall technically moves one space to the front. So, the code of the wall supposedly is like, the wall should push you, not crush you. Because it's moving forward, so technically it's pushing you. But I... I think that probably will be something bad in the coding. So instead, when the wall moves forward, you are considered inside of the wall, so you are crushed. I don't know how that even works, but but I mean that's a logical thing. That's this logic, so let's hope for the best. Let me wait for my clock key. Also, I'm probably gonna use this guy then. Okay, I'm waiting for my clock key, and let's do that. You know when the wall is gonna move? Because he starts shaking. Now 
the geese. So he shouldn't move fast enough when he does that. You're gonna get crushed. And he moves forward again. The problem is that your character also moves slowly. So, don't rely your life on this. I might probably use this one instead, so I can see how much health we got. I might start moving backwards. This is gonna take a while. Never mind! Well, we survived the wall of death. I'm gonna wait until my clock to... I mean, yeah, I'm a big crushing dino. I like to crush people. I'm gonna wait until the clock to finish... What is the name? Ah! For the clock to charge. Just in case. Also water. Bully flat as a pancake in the cartoon. Kinda like that. A flat pancake dino. Kind of the same thing that happens with Maximus. Most of the times. Uh, How long this shit gonna take to reload? Okay. So here we are now. We're gonna pick this key. Hey, level up again. But I think what we need to do is... Uh, this hall hides our master biggest threat. The key and the magic prophecy has told that the cursed tree must never find this. We altered the staff, but could not destroy it. Hmm. Oh, wait! I think that's one of the spells. I think it should be probably one of the spells. Let's try. Hmm. This whole high are away or master, the biggest threats, the key and the magic prophecy has told the cursed tree must never find this. We altered the staff, but we could not destroy it. Okay. So I think I should use probably one of these spells. Because if you can see this is the six sigils or the symbols of the spell. So that means basically, uh, I need to remember what is exactly the spell or what I need to do. I think there was in one of the books, but I don't want to go all the way back and, and think of the book. So I'm going to try to remember if I can. If not, then I'm probably going to be here stuck for several hours, because I'm derpy. And I really don't want to be derpy. Oh wait, I think I know what it is. Hold on. No, 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 wait, I think it's not that. I think it needs to be the symbol. I think. Yeah, there we go. Okay, this puzzle is gonna be horrible. Why? You guys will see. This is... Memory. But the moment you fail one 
of the symbols. <laughs> yeah, the moment you find one of the symbols, they are all gonna be uh, reset it. So this is a very extreme memory game. Hmm. This was here, this was here, this was here, and this was here. Okay, so that's a thing for now. <laughs> this is gonna be a real problem because it's it's probably gonna take me a long time. I this dino doesn't have the best memory of all, so I'm gonna be using some tricks because I'm a tricky dino. Um, I don't know what is this one. Damn it. You know what? I should look for other. There we go. Oh, is this one? Is this one? Is this one? Is this one? And is this one? Well, that's something. <laughs> now we need to keep looking for more things, like shields. Oh my god! I can't believe I'm making it. Uh. I had not seen this one before. Just screenshots. I mean, that can work too. Damn it. Okay, this one goes here, so that's good. This one goes here, this one goes here. I think this was here, this was here, and everything was like this. So I think that's something. Also, there is this one. So you guys can see also all of these spells are kind of like the spells that we... Oh, that was lucky. Oh, that was unlucky. Hmm. That's not too bad, actually. Okay, we're actually not doing that bad. Hmm, so that means... That's so far all what I got, or, I, or all what I remember. No wait, this one was here. That's all that I remember! I don't remember anything more after that. That was a lucky guess. Uh, oh shoot. Uh... Wee! I'm being lucky. Damn it! Damn it. Oh well, it's okay. Uh, that's... Oh, it was here. Okay. Oh, that means it should be like this. This one is probably gonna go here too, like this. Damn, this is really tough, I'm not gonna lie. And that's all I remember! Because I'm doopy! Ah, uh, shit. Oh, fuck. Uh, I don't know where, it, where this was. I think it was on there. Not sure. Eee! Hmm. Time. I don't remember what time was. Oh, that was heal. Health. Okay, so health is there. Okay. This was here, I think. This is here. This goes here, this goes here, this goes... Fuck. So this is here. This goes here. This is here. This one goes here. These are together like this. I kind of remembered a little bit of some of them. Okay, there we go. 
So this one goes here. I think this one was here. If I remember correctly. Yeah, there we go. So that's how we were. Health is up there. We are almost done. We just need one, two, three, four, five pa pairs. Shit. Ooh, nice. Uh, oh, sweet. So we need. Oh, shoot. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Okay, there we go. I think that's all now. So now we just need to try to don't do a stupid shit and we will be fine. I think this health was on top. Fucking health. Okay, now it's this. And this health is goes here. Kind of like that. Got it. These are crossed like this. This is the ceiling spell. This is like this. I think this one goes like this. And the fire goes like this. These two are blue. This is uh, this is this type of ceiling spell. Uh, this one was here and this one was here. There we go. So that's it. Jesus Christ, that was horrible. Three humans that have faced Malus. Is that us? Me, Randall, and... There? Will he still be alive somewhere? Will he be the black shadow I keep running into? The one that destroyed my car? The cursed tree. This feels like a Resident Evil puzzle. A body tainted by the hands of evil shall be free once more. All the spells to you. Let's see. can save. Oh, there you go. Okay, let me go back to the castle before something else. Oh god, so many, so many things. Oh god, so many things. Okay, fine. You are forcing me to do this. Okay, who else wants more? There is so many of these spheres. Wrong spell. Another one, really? Now who came? Oh, this thing. You're dead. Well, that was badass. Now there is another monster there. I need to leave because I'm running out of things. Melee are gone. Honestly, I prefer melee because at least with melee I got a little bit more of uh, control over it.
Well then. I'm gonna need to use my guns now. Why? Because we're gonna need to look for that guy. So... Let's go back to the house. Okay, so now we're back to the house. This is gonna be horrible because this is what I need to do now. I'm back at the original house. Oh wait, this is good actually. Because we can test something. Uh, Shade, what was the phone number that I needed to call? Uh, do you have it here? Oh, okay, thank you. So, let's call to this phone number. Zero zero four nine zero I think that's it. <laughs> yes, this is actually a thing. I know, her face was priceless. So, okay. We need to look for this shadow-like creature. So this is gonna take a little while. Hopefully we run into him. It's random, so... So I'm not sure if I will be able to run into him. I really need to. Because the way he appears is random. What the fuck? Oh, this is gonna take a while. Because we need to look for that shadow-like creature now. It can be anywhere in the house. Oh, there it is. Looks like Phoenix Wright, but anyways. Deja vu music. Anyway, this guy is uh This is supposedly the main protagonist of the first cursed game. Well, Miss Jennifer Lloyd, I suppose this makes us even. I assume you have a lot of questions. Will you do I will do my best to answer. I also have discovered what must be done to win against the demons. What happened to you? Years ago, I went down into the abandoned mine at the request of Tim, your father. I had my own reasons for wanting to explore the area, but your safe return was priority. After I returned successfully, I learned firsthand that I did not bring you back. It was a demon using your likeness to infiltrate your town and spread this corruption. My memory is very vague from the whole incident, all I remember is going down the steps. After that, I woke up in the cultist base. I was attacked and infected by some kind of possession magic or disease, so I began to change. My body was corrupted, but somehow my mind held on, and I had occasional control. Over the last few years, I have slowly staggered my way back to this house. My family had been taken by the legions of the void. I felt it was my fault for leaving. But in my occasional dose of control, I did what I could to try to lead someone here. I had to get someone who was not corrupted to find out the truth. 
And that ended up being me. Why did you strip my car? Anyone who showed up will surely leave as soon as they meet the voice creatures. I needed somebody to fight back and understand the entire picture. I was surely fate that brought you and the Reaper to this place. So yeah, basically this is the first guy of the first game. What did you learn about the Lord? But it has led me to startling findings and my misconception about them. A huge part of this scripture describes two massive elder crystals. The God's Eye and the Essence of Fate. As I do the Lunars, I also had ties to the boys since I was among the enemy. I learned that there is only one crystal that birthed all of the gods. Luna and Malus both came from the same source and it lies beneath this house. Wow, so we have both been after the same thing. That's why we're both down here. The second revelation is about the staff to the moon. As soon as it was created, it was written that Luna herself be began to get weaker. I uh, discovered that the inventor stole a piece of the crystal to make it. It was carved out from the inside center, so nobody could see it was partially hollow. After that, it says she lost a major war and was not seen since. At least until now. Yeah, more lore. Jesus Christ, the guy who created this game have a lot of creativity. The Lunar Prophets first saw three human beings to downfall of Malus. They speak of three who have stowed against him and lived on. And if I'm not mistaken, I know of three people who fit that description. You, me, and your friend Randall. With us three together, we can use the staff to summon Malus to this realm. We will be locked in a ritual combat until one side wins. What good we will do? He will just come back like he always has. This is where my knowledge is key. As a monster, I learned a huge secret. Malus once wanted the staff for another reason entirely. His demon discovered that he could change the staff to control time instead of life. If he replaces the staff orb with his own essence, the staff of the sun will be born. This staff can open rifts in time and allow him to travel back to any point. But he ended up not wanting to sacrifice any of his energy to his process. Now the staff dis dissembled, deemed the whole experiment too risky. He will extract his energy, we have the power to change the past to our fa favor. How far back go going time? If you use the crystal as a catalyst, so I imagine as far back as the crystal itself. Malus is only vulnerable outside the void, is why we must summon him here. And since the staff of the moon is needed in the summoning ritual, you can use it to fight. We will have to weaken him in ourselves and use the forbidden magic on him. This spell is free you? Besides me. He draws every energy out of things, it's our best option. So we trap Malus in combat here on air, weaken him, then cast Spirit Exilium on him. Well, this is gonna be a really, really intense thing. See you. Oh, that shadow is not gonna bother us again. It really feels like that. But yeah, this guy really had a lot of ingenious. Okay, let's go down. Meep. So there is Randall. I know there is that guy. But we still need to look for... Uh... We still not complete the staff. 99% of the game complete. We're almost done with this. So we need to go again to Malu's area. It really feels like that, but my god, the guy is impressive. Anyways, we're almost uh, done with this. Sword. I need to go to the castle because I need to complete the staff. No, that's a thing. Oh wait, no, I remember where is the temple, I think. There. And with that, we got the Staff of the Moon. I think we don't got to go down there. I think we don't. In 
Instead, let's go back to the place. Finish too, as he made it and got run by another fan game on the own. Oh yeah, that's true. Thank goodness this came through the portal with me. Yep, it did. Wait, actually. I don't know if I'm gonna need this. So I'm gonna get them with me instead. Uh, where am I? Oh yeah, I'm here. Uh, let me see. Just to be... Safe. 100% but I think we're still missing something. We can begin the summoning once three of us are here. If I just call Randall's phone. I think we don't need to call Randall's phone, but I can try. I forgot what was Randall's phone. Damn it. No, wait, I think Randall was in the other world. Yeah, because he was fighting the other monsters. Let me check. Meep. Write the number again. Beep. Also, Globito. There we go. Okay, let's call Randall. Randy is Jen, where are you now? I just got back from the void. Old Green told me you need something important. Yeah, so I guess he filled you in what's going on. Yes, Luna and I know exactly what's up. We're gonna kick some Malus ass, right? So you know who I really am. Is that gonna make everything weird? Are you kidding me? I always knew you were somehow destined for big bigger thing. Maybe not this big, but still. You're still Jennifer, right? Of course. I just have a, a much longer memory now, like millennia longer. Well, this explains a lot about your bad luck. Remember the call sacrificed you and said it was necessary for them to finish your plan? If you were even suspected to be the last lunar, they will want you one. I guess that makes sense. And my bad and my dad hid the lunar key cause he wasn't totally loyal. Yeah, I have a lot of pieces to fit together now. So what do you need me to do? We need three people who have faced Malus to summon him. To this world and fight. Well, there's you and me. Who's the third? Spencer Carrington. He's still alive. Holy crap, you're kidding me. Well, tell him I'm sorry I took his bracelet. Anyway, I'll be back down here by the crystal when you need me. Thanks, Randy. I owe you like a million. And that's it. Now we can leave. Yay. Now we are ready to... Complete this game. Let me save here just to be safe. Oh no, there is a bola. I'm gonna run from the bola. Randy is still traumatized by Abuela? Probably. I mean, just look at that horrible, creepy-ass grandma. Of course I would be traumatized if I was him. But both of them are here now. Sweet. Let's save. Beep. Give me the stuff of the moon and we shall begin. Make sure you are prepared for this one-way trip. Okay. Then give me a moment real quick. If you want me to be prepared, then give me a moment.
Ok, dos sin Fister. Damn it. Also, I love how the music just pauses like nothing. Aha! That's what I love about this game. You can find ways to make this work. And if you don't, it's okay. You still find ways to make this work. I don't think this one fits. Anyways, I got everything now with me. And now I'm ready for this. <laughs> Oh yeah, you need the staff of the moon. Tetris! Yes, we got two trees. And now we got music. Not sure if it's gonna be copyrighted or not, but yeah, we're gonna have music. Oh, and deliver the demon to us. We lock together until this weak energy is extracted. But yeah, we're getting ready for what will probably be the final boss. That looks like the Oricalcum seal, but okay. Good luck, you guys. We can do this. Everyone just hold your ground. This is the thing that is gonna be kind of interesting. You guys will see why. So, this is the Malus fight. Who summons me to this rich realm? You? It cannot be. You will be not bested by mortals again. You will fall one by one. So now... We're gonna have to fight depending on the guy we're using. Oh, got Darn it. So this is just like the first game. This is literally a recreation of how the first game combat was. Ow. It was really stiff. Oh god. I might die here. <laughs> but yeah, basically you're gonna be using all the other protagonists of the other games. And the guy was even... interesting enough... To recreate the battle style of all the characters from the past games. Orical Conceal from the Yu-Gi-Oh! Yeah, exactly! The Orical Conceal from Yu-Gi-Oh! I kinda want to freeze escape and see if this skips the dialogue. Oh, it skips! Okay, perfect. So, let's try. Okay, I think I can only hit like one or two times. Gosh darn it. This really feels like it's the first game, oh my god. Oh, he left. Randall, he's heading your way. Maybe well, so, second game mechanic. Just like in the second game. Oh god. Oh god, I don't know how to dodge this guy. I didn't dodge enough. Ok, 
Okay, the second battle style is not really that bad. It's just some of the attacks I don't know how to dodge them. That will be the problem. At least I, I know that I can skip the cutscene, so we can do that. Okay, thank you. Actually, I'm gonna use this. Oh, it didn't do ups. It did absolutely nothing. Ow. Okay, there we go. So it's Randall time. This is where, I, where I'm gonna be struggling a lot. I still don't know how to dodge that attack. Okay, I know how to dodge that one. Oh, I need to dodge. I didn't dodge again. Yeah, this is the final boss, Cello. Well, also rare. Welcome to the stream. Okay, so let's do that again. I'm having a lot of problems because the game literally made you fight the final boss with the protagonist of the past games. So I'm struggling because I need to change battle, battle styles between first, second, and third game. I tried to use the fire spell. Damn it. I was too slow. Damn it, I was too slow again. You know what, let's heal. Okay. Yeah, and you can see because of the different game styles, because they literally fight like in their own games. So, Randall. Oh god. This is gonna be horrible. I still don't know how to dodge that one. Okay, I see. Depending on the section of the screen he's coming. Okay. This is not too bad, thankfully. Okay, that's Randall. Yeah, it does. It's awakening. Use the magic when you have the chance. Okay, so now it's time for Jennifer. Oh god! Wow, that was a lot of damage! <laughs> Damn, that this that literally destroyed me. That's a lot of damage, my god. Okay. I'm gonna need to change the strategies for that. I think I know what my strategy probably is gonna be. Okay, let's give the staff. Let's skip and let's go for the battle again. At least now I learned the mechanics for Randall. That is the one that was giving me a lot of problems. Okay, that's the first one. 
Oh, it's Spencer again. Oh, this is gonna be quite a thing. At least for the Spencer, it's not really that complicated now. Now that I know how to dodge this guy. That's the second guy. Okay, so with Jennifer I'm gonna change tactics instead. I can't use the clock because it's a battle, so... So where is he? Yeah, let's use the shield for now. Oh, come on, I don't have enough magic. There we go. I had it in the beginning of the game. <laughs> well, not at the beginning, but later on. I am losing control. My energy escaping. Damn you humans. What have you done to me? Jesus Christ, this boss was a thing. <laughs> but I love that they literally make you fight the boss with the three different protagonists of the three cursed games. Oh yeah, but the game's not done yet. Whatever happens now, it's all up to you too. I might have left an important detail. He who casts the summoning magic for fees their life. I didn't tell you because you will try to stop me, but I had to be done. I gladly return to my family now. This is what I wanted. So long and good luck. So yeah. Now the... The first protagonist of the game is now dead. Randall. This emergency broadcast goes to all people around the globe. A crisis of biblical proportion is upon us. A towering monster has appeared outside the city. The abomination is several story stalls and nothing or armies do seems to slow it down. Please evacuate immediately. This is not a hoax. Repeat, evacuate immediately. Jesus Christ! Now what do we do? We don't got his essence and now he's miles away. It's gonna destroy everyone and everything. Wait, the staff. What about it? Quick! Come with me to the escape room over here. I'm sorry things went this way, Randy, but I need your help one more time. Of course, Jen, anything. I'm going, af I'm going after him. At full power, I may be able to take his essence without the staff. Return the staff orb and complete the crystal, then guard it with everything you got. I might be gone a while and they are coming. I vote to protect you. This is my destiny. Being a goddess doesn't change anything, and besides... You have always been a goddess in my eyes. I hope I don't die, because I forgot to save! I love this battle weapon choices. Spencer, Sword and Shield, Randall the Hammer, and Jennifer the fucking AK-47. I, I'm still surprised that only one single person work in this game. This is what really makes me, makes it impressive for me. One single person work in all these three games. I 
I don't know if I can be able to beat this boss because I forgot to grow fish to this lad. Yes. Yeah, only one pace person made his three games. It's like impressive. So yeah, let's see if I can be able to beat these without dying. I gotta find Malus fast. Please hang on, Randy. Oh, this is chapter 7. Oh yeah, she actually was the goddess of the lunar people. In case you're curious. 10 minutes later. There's Randall. What are you doing here, old man? I have to stop them. They can take the crystal. I am sorry, Hero. Your time has come. It brings me no pleasure, I assure you. Your deeds have been most valiant. No, I can't lose here. I have to keep going. You are already gone, I'm afraid. I cannot allow you to stay here. You will be considered undead. I will have to take you either way. I don't care. I just need a few more minutes. I can't end like this. Please, let me stay here and keep my promise. For her. Very well, human. For her. I love how still got the hammer in his hand. That's the else then. I have a goddess to protect. As do I. I think I shall join you before we go. So yeah, while they are still protecting the crystal. That means I will be here. There's Malus. He's almost reached a major city. I gotta get close quick. Hey, I can fly. Oh. Uh. What is the healing spell? Like this. Oh god, this is gonna be bad. I'm gonna put this guy here. Wow, he doesn't let me. Yep. That was badass, but I fuck it off. Ah, uh, try again. Oh, it leaves me start from here. Okay, let's try that again. Wow, the game didn't let me uh, get the weapons. There we go. Oh my god, I got a full set of I got a lot of arms now. Okay, that doesn't help at all. He's gonna be tough, actually. I don't know how to dodge the attacks yet. I don't know how to dodge that attacks. At least the, the circles, I don't know how to dodge them. I don't know if I need to fly in between them, like Superman 64 style or what. But let's see. Okay, let's try. Okay. No, that's not it! That's not it either. I don't need to fly between them. Okay, I don't know who to dodge the rings there. The other attacks I kind of know, but not the rings. What if I change weapons, actually? Let's try using this. 
And I don't know if the shield is gonna help or not. It's weird how that thing works. Oh my god, yes, you need to fly through the rings. So that's how it needs to be. You really need to fly through the rings. But it's a very finicky like path. Yeah, it's a very finicky path. Actually, let me change weapons. I think it will be better if I use this one. Yeah, I do have to fly through them like AK Superman 64 style. I need to heal. So that's gonna make it tough because. Oh god. Especially because the. Oh god. The way the rings are, are it's really finicky. Yeah, the rings are very have a very weird ass hitbox. Okay, they have a very weird ass hitbox. That I really don't know how to dodge them correctly. Oh, I need to follow the la the second to last one. So it's not the first one in front, it's actually the one that is behind the first one. Oh. Kind of a very finicky way to actually uh, do this. Oh. Maybe I can heal a little bit. Okay. Okay, this shield. The laser sound is unfamiliar. Oh. Oh god. Some of the hitboxes are really weird, or at least how they work. There we go. Oh, it's gonna take three attacks. Yeah, it's a bunch of Emas trying to be 3D, so of course it's gonna be quite uh, tricky. Especially the ring section is like really hard to actually control correctly. Oh god. I literally ran into that. Okay, let's try to avoid all this ring. Oh god, this is quite a weird as pattern. Okay, there you go. Okay, I need to match the bottom. And there we go. Is the lazy sound from Starfall 64 during the area 6 ball? It can probably be. It's done. I have his core. I can create the staff of the sun and traverse time. Randy, I'm coming back.
Oh my god. After I noticed how to dodge the rings, I had a little bit less troubles. Oh, hi, Green Reaper. The queen returns victorious. Welcome back, my lady. Uh, where's Randy? What happened here? I am sorry, my queen. Your friend Randall is gone. He fell defending your strength to the very end. It was an honor to have fought alongside a mortal of such... You are fortunate to have so many care for your trust. Lucky, huh? Everyone fa fights and falls in my wake. Through the ages, I feel like all I bring is conflict. I just want peace for everyone, but as long as the gods are here, they fight over. Nothing ever changes. That is exactly what you what you saw the staff of the sun. It is your chance to go back. You can go back to the ward this time. You will win. I believe in you. Of course, the war. I, um... I see. You were never going back to the war, were you? You intend to go much further back. I know what I need to do. I know exactly what the world needs. But I'm afraid. Afraid I'm making a mistake. Raising the gods from history will not erase all conflict. You know. Maybe? I know that, but nobody will fight for me anymore. I want humanity to fight for themselves. I cannot pretend to understand the burdens you face, but I do know your heart. You will do what you believe is the best thing for everyone. Yes. But what will a stuffy asshole like me know about any of this, right? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so, so much for everything. You really have been here for me all along, but I suppose it's a this farewell. Oh god! Woof. Oh god, this guy is a pain. Okay, you can... Oh, okay, I need to destroy the hands. Got it. Okay, so let's focus on the hands first, and try to avoid all of this. Okay, that's the hands, so now we need to take care of you. Oh, he only got a bit shooting. This feels like a Tohu game. That was your last chance to stop me, you bastard. Trying to end what bind us. Yeah, it literally was like Andrew's fight. That was quite interesting.
Here I am, at the beginning of all things. Am I making the right choice? My people, my family, my friends. Even Randall has fought and died over me. All I wanted was a peaceful life, at least with us gods gone. You will have that. Everyone I've lost, thank you for all you've done, but your lives will be much better off without me. Let's make a toast to the time waiting for tomorrow. So with the crystal broken, we literally changed the pass of the time. Ten thousand BC. At the end of time, we'll be fine, you and I. I love how you can literally see how the t the time is changing right there. In the sun. So we literally destroyed the crystal that created the existence. Yeah. So by destroying the crystal, we prevent the existence of gods. That in this case, Malus and Luna. That are both of us, and that changed the ta the time, the timeline. Made in 2020-22 with Game Maker 8.0. So these are the credits now too. I think I'm hunting Ben Mac Ben McCarthy. Mad Maccabi. And shaky. But yeah, this is basically the... This was a really, really cool uh, game and trilogy. That's how I feel. But yeah, again, really cool that there is this trilogy of games. Katie Hout. And also, free on Steam. A special thanks to the following people whose positivity made this game happen. Yeah, because keep in mind that these three games are free on on Steam. Mike Panutes. Airbot Games, King Dulch, and Sir Phobos 84. So I think that's people who motivated this guy. Look at Eek. The tower of the second game. The mines from the first game. Eleanor. I think that's a YouTuber. Yeah, the three of them are actually free. Blueberry Tree. So you can find the Cursed Trilogy on the stream, and all of them are free to play. And they are very small. None of them weighs more than 500 megabytes. I think this is the heaviest one, and it's like 300 or 400 megabytes. And thank you to anyone who enjoyed these games. Because my god, these games are quite amazing. Dedicated to everyone with a passion to care. Ah, with a passion to create games. Neek! <laughs> I, fe I feel these games deserve more recognition because they are really good. And for a single person to make all of these games... It's actually really, really impressive. Look, sweetheart, is the boy that moved in down the street. He looks around your age. Why don't you introduce yourself? Make some new friends. And that's it. That's the end of the game. I don't know if there is a... Well, that was a post credit scene. That was literally just like... Almost two hours of stream. But yeah, that's it for the game.
Also, if we look at the percentage of the game, uh, Curse 3. Yeah, that's literally 100% of the game. So, what you guys saw is literally the best ending of the game. There is a bad ending. And that is if you collect the staff and go fight Malus at the, at the other dimension. Then you get the bad ending. Because in that ending, Randall actually dies to protect you. And you sacrifice just with Randall to prevent Malus to escape ever again. So yeah, we got the true ending. And it only took us 14 hours of game. But yeah, I'm really happy with this game. It went really good. It was... It was quite extensive. I'm not gonna lie. It was one hour and a half, so... I guess I'm gonna be calling it here because... Yeah, technically that is the game, and for the moment I think I don't got any other game that I can play. But I probably will see you guys for another game, another stream tomorrow. You know what? Hmm. I don't know if Cello and other friends will be up, because I can try to stream tomorrow day by daylight with friends. Because, you know, the next weekend is going to be Super Mario Wonder, so I'm going to be on Mario on drugs, but Abuela was really the best. Yeah, it, it really scared the crap out of me. <laughs> but yeah, it was a really fun game. It was really fun. I, I was able to maximize my characters and all that, but yeah, that's literally a curse tree. Again, the trilogy is free on Steam, so if anyone's want to... <laughs> yeah, the Abuela. So yeah, if anyone wants to try the the trilogy of the games, uh, I think... Uh, for the sake, I'm gonna get going now. No problem, Cello, thanks for coming to the stream. It was nice to have you here in the finale of this game. Fun stack! Uh, I wanted Cello to play this game. I was suggesting him to play them because they are actually really fun. But I ended up streaming them because they are actually really cool. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. These games deserve more recognition. Uh, yeah, Maximus can do me the favor. Thank you. So yeah, for anyone who is curious, yeah. The entire trilogy of Cursed is literally free on, on Steam. So thankfully Maximus is sharing the links to them. They are fun, so if any of you guys want to give it a try, play it by themselves, you guys are free to do that. It's a really good game. And, well, you guys, you saw me there. <laughs> it's really fun. But I really hope all of you guys had fun in tonight's stream. Again, thank you, Hajime, Yusuf, Proto Stardust, and Cello to be here. Both of you guys, thank you for being here for the finale of this game. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow for another game. I don't know what it will be, but I will let you know, guys. Take care, everyone. Have a good night and stay awesome.